Hey, what's up YouTube? In this video, we're gonna be installing the latest developer build of iOS 16, and we're gonna do this entirely on device. Now this process is pretty similar from year to year and from beta to beta. If you're already running iOS 16, you can install the update in the settings app under general software update. Now for everyone else installing any iOS 16 beta for the first time, the process is as follows. Basically, we're going to download and install the developer beta profile, reboot our device, and then download the iOS 16 beta via an OTA software update. These are the devices that are supported. Please make a backup of your data before doing this. There's always a way to go back to iOS 15 if you want to downgrade. So first step, we're going to find that developer beta profile. Now, due to copyright issues, we cannot link anything, but you can easily Google things. You're looking for the iOS 16 developer beta profile. Now, once it's downloaded, just tap to start installing the profile. From here, go to the settings app, go to profile downloaded, and here go through agreeing to the terms and conditions. Again, not going to display this as it may contain copyright issues with Apple. We can now reboot our devices when prompted to do so. And once we're back up and running, the third and final step is to launch the settings app, go to general software update, and here we can install the latest iOS 16 beta. All you have to do is tap download and install. If it's grayed out, just make sure you're connected to Wi-Fi and have your iPhone plugged in and charging. But that pretty much wraps up this video. Remember, Apple servers are totally slammed right now, so just be patient if your download is taking a while. But once downloaded, the update will process and finish entirely on its own. Your phone will shut down. You should see an Apple logo, a progress bar. And before you know it, you'll be on the very first build of iOS 16. But before I conclude, I wanted to let everyone know about our sponsor, Squarespace. Squarespace gives people a powerful and beautiful online platform to create your own unique website. You can connect with your audience and generate revenue through gated member-only content. Manage your members, send email communications, and leverage audience insights all in one easy-to-use platform. You can create a community on your Squarespace website with a fully integrated commenting system that supports threaded comments, replies, and likes. Use their powerful blogging tools to categorize, share, and schedule your posts to extend Squarespace's already powerful e-commerce capabilities with Squarespace extensions. These new third-party tools can help you manage inventory, promote products, streamline bookkeeping, reconcile and file sales tax, and ship items across the globe. Display posts from your social profiles on your website, automatically push website content to your favorite social media channels in return, go to squarespace.com for a free trial. And when you're ready to launch, go to squarespace.com slash I-C-R-A-C-K to save 10% on your first purchase of a website or domain. Now, like I mentioned earlier, there's always a way to go back to iOS 15 if you want to downgrade. Be sure to share this video with your friends if they're at all interested in installing iOS 16 because it really couldn't be any easier. Anyway, thank you so much for watching and for the support. Subscribe, all that fun stuff for the latest news on iOS 16. I'll catch you guys real soon, but until next time, this is Tony signing out.